Mayor Marty Walsh is warning that Boston could be moving into the red zone on the state's COVID map. Yeah, and with the number of cases going up again in the city, this could affect reopening plans. Here's WBZ's Michael Cross. The red zone, for me, does not make us think that we have to shut down the city of Boston. We're not at that point. Boston Mayor Marty Walsh says the city is nearing the red zone on the state's high-risk community monitoring system, and that means people need to be more careful. You can see there's a little more activity happening in the city. Uh, so there's more people out and about. Uh, I've noticed more people walking around. On Wednesday, the city reported 63 new positive coronavirus cases. The city has seen roughly eight new cases per every 100,000 people in the population, which is putting it close to the red zone category. Just to give you a sense, we've been climbing in our number of cases per 100,000, even though our positive rate is still pretty low, relatively low at 2.7 percent. The city says it will be keeping a close eye on the COVID the data in neighborhoods and in the city's hospitals. The mayor says people need to remain vigilant and help them prevent the virus from spreading. We need to wear masks. You need to keep social distancing. You need to wash your hands. You need to take care of yourself. So we want people to be careful. Today, the mayor also announced a partnership with the Boston Red Sox to help randomly test teachers in the city for the coronavirus. The Red Sox are also donating 60,000 reusable masks to teachers and students. Reporting from City Hall Plaza, I'm Mike LaCrosse, WBC News. All right.